Hey guys, I know it's been a hot minute since I've been on here, but I wanted to create a video for you guys showing you how I do my visual merchandising in store. Um, and if this is your first time coming across this video, um, I am a boutique owner. I have an e-commerce site and then a brick and mortar as well in Katati, California. Um, so I kind of just made this channel to share my business journey and kind of tips and whatnot on um, the life of being a business owner. Um, but yeah, so today we are gonna revamp some of the displays we have in store. We got a lot of fall shipment in, so we have a lot of cute sweaters and whatnot. So let's get to it. So this is the before picture. This is what I currently have on the table. Sorry, it's kind of messy. Um, sold a shirt on that mannequin just last night and we didn't have time to change anything. Um, all of my decor that I see is all thrifted. I'm like a thrifty junkie. Um, I love to collect like decor pieces and whatnot. Um, like those boxes that I have, I got like eight crates for like five bucks off of Craigslist. This table right here was 10 bucks from a thrift store. This guy here, I don't even remember, I picked him up from a yard sale. But yeah, so this is one of the tables we are gonna be redoing, kind of making it a little bit more fall vibes and what. <laughs> what I put together just kind of gather some of our newest arrivals and put them on the table um, I like to add just a little bit of pop of color with the joggers and then the, the brown hat as well kind of gives it a nice little pop and I like how it kind of ties into this rack just a little bit um, but yeah it's always important to that your mannequins are displaying your newest arrivals and you're piecing together cute outfits um, but yeah, this is kind of what we have going on right now. On to the next table. So this one I already started to work on um, like yesterday, I think it was, but we already started to sell some of the pieces. So I'm just gonna bring it a little bit back to life and the mannequins I never got to update. So I definitely need to change those so that way it complements the table a little bit more. Um, so yeah, let me start working on that. And I'll show you guys what it looks like after. Is not that common That's what Gucci told us For you it seems to be kind of foreign To cop the new rap that's a must Grandma's money is spent for the new CD Alright you guys, this is what I was able to pull together Kind of updated the table a little bit with our newest bodysuits and I try to kind of create an outfit too. So like this is all something you can pair with our jeggings that we have. And these are the mannequins as well. We get new shipment in every week. So I'm always constantly having to change all of our displays around the shop and things just sell so quickly. So it's a lot of work for me, but I try to stay on top of it. So now I'm moving on to the mannequins from the window display. So these two were right there. Um, these weren't the original outfits that I had worn, but I'm assuming we had sold that top. So the girls just threw on a cheetah top with the shorts. Um, but it's time to revamp these guys and put them in fall outfits. This is our last dress. So I always try to remind the girls, like if there's only one thing left and it's on the mannequin, let's change her and put this item on the floor so it can sell. Cause obviously it's a bestseller. Um, so yeah, let me get working on these guys and I'll show you what I put together. Okay, so this is what I put together for the window. I didn't even get to finish, but I just wanted to show you the outfits. I'll show you the other ones. 
another window as well. Definitely like fall vibes. I just didn't get to finish that rock. But yeah, that's what we pieced together. Okay, so that's pretty much it for my visual merchandising. I didn't even get to finish like everything. There's still a lot more I want to do for the windows. It's just adding decor pieces and whatnot. But I'm glad I was able to change the outfits. Um, I changed a couple of the tables as well. And I probably change our um, displays like once a week or every other week too, depending on how much inventory we get in and if the mannequins the outfits that they're wearing if they sell pretty fast too which tends to happen so we're, we're always constantly having to change them um but yeah that's it for today um and i hope to make another video very soon follow me on instagram because i'm always posting like little things for my business so you guys can kind of check that out um i'll link it on the screen send me dms let me know you watched this video or comment below um, and let me know what else I can share with you guys because I feel like I've learned a lot over the three years of being a business owner and I want to share that with other people who are looking to do the same. So reach out to me. Let me know if you have any questions or you need any advice related to business, whatever it could be. All right, guys. Thanks.